I'll be the first to admit that I will try just about anything new. Music, fashion, tech, it really doesn't matter as long as I get to give it a fair shake. But the most recent of these unusual discoveries has been all about two words, butter and oil. Let me explain. This morning I put unsalted grass-fed butter in my cup of coffee. Now I don't know what exactly for or what it would do, only that I read an article on Facebook about it and it's supposed to be healthy. Seems to be the way everyone tries out the weirdest trends these days, isn't it? Could it be true that butter plus coffee equals a healthier life? There's different conflicting evidence right now, but um, they do have uh, animal studies. On animal studies, they show that there has been a reduction of fat deposits and an increase of uh, improvement of body mass index. Um, they have shown some human studies that showed this as well, the reduction of fat and improvement of body mass. However, that has been mostly in obese men and in healthy individuals, they haven't really shown that to be happening yet. Now this is fresh on the heels of another activity circulating social media, oil pulling. It's an ancient trick that's been gaining a lot of fans lately. Put a batch of coconut oil in your mouth, let all the toxins collect in the oil, and spit it out, and supposedly be a lot healthier. So when you look at the information from oil pulling, commonly you see online coconut oil, extra virgin cold pressed coconut oil. This is what you want to use. But there's no research supporting that. In fact, this ancient Ayurvedic technique of oil pulling uses sesame oil, organic sesame oil, which goes through a process when you put it in your mouth of saponification, which really makes it a soapy kind of consistency in your mouth. In fact, if you hold it too long, you'll reabsorb them through the oral mucosa of the mouth. So what I've learned today, remedies like oil pulling or butter in your morning cup of joe can be beneficial. But remember not to be so quick to believe every fad you read when poking around online.